Lex Love, you go subscribe because I did. Ah, thank you, Jackson. <laughs>
all those people were there to see him and I don't think it fully hit him until like his first uh, talking moment. <laughs> You could tell it was all hitting him at that moment and I was like, oh my god. It was just really beautiful to see him get so affected like that in such a positive way. I just thought it was beautiful to see because I know he's always like, he's always saying stuff like, I don't know if they'll buy tickets. I don't know if anyone will show up. Like, so for him to just see that and digest that and process that, it was just really nice to see. And you could tell when it fully, fully hit. And I was just like, oh my God, please don't let me cry. Oh. <laughs> During the show, I don't know, I guess because this was the last North American stop that I went to, everything was just like even more sentimental than normal. And so like for me, I cried during All The Way and Dopamine. Like those two songs just really, I don't know, they really tugged at my heartstrings. But I have been very emotional this week because I knew that the last stop was coming and I honestly don't know when I'm going to see him again. So. It was all just hitting me and I was just like, oh dear God, like, oh dear God, when am I going to hear this live again? I don't even know. <laughs> I don't know and so I was just so emotional <laughs> and yeah I don't think I've cried during a concert in a really long time something about all the way it just really like just really hits my soul and especially this these past two weeks I have really been listening to that song a lot and I don't know it's just really making me so emotional I'm just like oh dear god like why well, I'm about to cry but yes okay I digress I wish I could just go to the third floor right now.
not want the show to end, honestly. But he most definitely did not either. <laughs> it was really cute. We had two, we basically had two encores. And he was just going around from one side to the other in the middle and dancing with his dancers. And Sean was there and it was really cute to see them like dance. And I'm glad he was there to support him for his last stop. don't know if I have said this like in a previous video but I've literally verbalized it to my friends but I don't know if I've said it in a video but like I just want to take some time to appreciate the live band a live band just really brings a whole different vibe to a show and I just really really appreciated the fact that he used a live band Ugh, it just elevates everything And I also want to talk about the dancers. I don't know if I actually mentioned them either, but they're all so good. Like, they're all so good. But I do have to say, my favorite dancer is Kat. I think she's so, so amazing. And they have really, really good chemistry. And that really showed, like, especially during the Greedy performance. <laughs> killing it and then the other dancer i only know his instagram name i don't know his real name his instagram is like zoker muse or something he 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 be killing it he be killing it oh, oh my god those two those two are my favorites i mean everyone is super super good obviously but like those two stick out to me the most and yeah i just wanted to mention that i don't know if i have mentioned it before but here we are And I just love when we can tell how excited Jackson is or like how happy he is because he just be going all out <laughs> with the dances. Like he goes even harder than like than I expect. Like, yeah, and he was definitely doing that in Mexico. Like he was going all out like for real for real and it was so cute he kept saying i love you and then he kept saying i want to kiss you like sir you can't actually say that you you can't like just please shh, shh. And he said that he wanted to hug everyone i was like oh my god you're like seriously the most precious person in the world like seriously you're like the sweetest soul ever like i literally can't 
but yeah it just made me happier to see him so happy i just really kept getting sad in ways because i was like wow i really don't know when i'm gonna have another um chance to see him again i don't know i have no idea but Okay, so while I was on the plane and in between a nap, I was crying and <laughs> I wrote a letter to Jackson. It's probably like really weird and cringy to like say this publicly, but I never like write a letter to him and am able to give it to him. Like, when am I gonna give this man a letter? When? For the meet and greet, we were not allowed to bring anything in there with us. So, when was I gonna be? When when am I gonna give him a letter? So I'm gonna do it now. This is probably like super cringy, but I don't know. I just felt like called to say this because I guess I was just inspired because of how touched he was at the show, and I just feel like I need to remind him. Uh, who he is <clears throat> uh, uh, uh. Dear Jackson You are such a bright light in millions of people's lives. You are special. You are unique You are definitely going to achieve everything you want to achieve in your lifetime. I have no doubts I know you always tell us to find our own magic to find our own happiness But for a lot of us aka your fans you are actually a part of of our happiness. Someone we go to when we're dealing with bad things, when we're dealing with good things, and everything in between. Your music is so comforting and therapeutic to so many people, and it always feels like a warm hug after an extremely terrible day at work. Like, that's what it feels like. You deserve all the love and more. Seeing you so loved in Mexico this week was something that filled my heart with so much joy. You are loved, and I hope you never forget that. Okay, don't forget. Yeah, so like none of this nonsense of I don't know if people will come to my show anymore. Like, please don't speak such things into your life. Like, I know how that can be and I know how that I, I understand why you feel that way. And it's natural to feel that way too. But I feel like this tour has taught you the complete opposite, you know? Like people will show up and out for you always and forever. You are such a special person who is already leaving a huge mark on this world already. Things are coming together for you and I love to see it unfold. It's beautiful to see. And uh, you know, hey, hope one day I can sit down with you and like just talk about life and other random stuff, you know, not a big deal. And uh, just vibe out and be present. Oh, and of course, make a reaction video. Just saying, I mean, a girl can dream, right? A girl can dream. Love one of your millions of fans, Lexi. I feel like I just had to get that out. I feel like I just had to say that. I don't know if the message will come across. I don't know. I'm just going with what's in my heart at the moment. Not to be cheesy, but that's literally... I literally feel like I have to say it out loud.
Of course, I want to see him again ahead in the clouds. If I go, I'll probably like be in the back where I can dance and I have room. And I will just watch from the back because I, I literally can't. I could sit down. So yeah, I don't know. We'll see, you know, the price. The price is what's really getting me with that though. Like that price, bro, that price. Maybe I'll just watch the live stream and pretend I'm there. <laughs> now I'm kind of getting sad because it was just such an amazing time. And there were a lot of revelations that came from this, good and bad. So like during this time, maybe I'll go deeper into that later, but I kind of already touched that in my New York concert video. Yeah, I just feel really inspired. So many good things happened and a lot of things that I just wasn't expecting to ever happen to me, honestly. Um, like ever and to just see him and talk about his journey and produce such amazing art for us to enjoy for just a short amount of time in a day it it was just amazing and it meant so so much to so many people and I'm so happy I was able to go to as many places as I went I was able to travel I was able to meet new people I was able to reunite with old friends well let me stop right there because I feel like this video is getting too long all right okay I will see y'all later peace Lex love you gonna subscribe because I did ah, thank you Jesse. <laughs>